is the owner of CelebStyleJewelry.com and I know you guys have been asking me a lot these days, what can I get that looks like the real thing but at a more affordable price and I think Gabby has one of our solutions. So tell us about your line. I kind of wanted to get all that bling without the cha-ching. Who doesn't? Um, <laughs> so, and also, um, you know, I found that like just looking at very elegant women, they, they know how to change their jewelry with their outfits. It's a nice, understated, kind of elegant, like a little sparkle here and there. Exactly. Not over the top, but of course. just a little bit. And I also really love um, the celebrities on the red carpet. So if I have an event that I'm going to where it's black tie, I really want to look like I'm wearing something that was handed down through my family, like a really beautiful estate piece. And that's really how I shop for the line. These are very oh, popular. Very cute. So you have like a little baguette and then a round diamond and then your micro pave band. I see. And all of the jewelry is sterling silver with platinum plating. Oh, so it's very high quality. Yeah, it's really durable. I actually um, throw mine in my Sonic jewelry cleaner with the rest of my real stuff. So mm -hmm. it, it sparkles all the time. We also do uh, what's called the Eternity Band. And an Eternity Band is anything where the diamonds go all the way around. Right. So all of the stackables are Eternity. Eternity. Mm -hmm. um, this is one of my favorites. It kind of has an antique look to it because it's in a square setting. Okay. As around. opposed to your traditional prong setting. I see. The one thing I love about Gabby is she's always decked out in bling. It's just kind of her style. It's very classic. And she's platinum and diamond head to toe. But now I find out some is real, some is fake, because she pulls it off so well. So let's see if we can, I want to figure out what's real, what's fake. Okay. That's so you, you take okay. a look at me and you take a little guess. Okay, well I see this on the, uh, on the display, so I know that that one's fake. Which you always thought was real. Which I always thought was real, but I'm guessing that your earrings are real. Yes. Because you've had those forever. Yes, the earrings are real. The watch is real. Yes. The watch is real. The bracelet is real. No. No? No. Oh my god. Well, together, when you wear the combination. Well, I think that's kind of the trick. It's all how you layer. A lot of times I'll wear uh, my tennis bracelet mm -hmm. with a bunch of uh, bangles. Right, right. So some lacquered bangles with a little bit of sparkle behind it. Yeah. Nobody would think that that was not that real. Was not real. And then, okay, your wedding ring, real. Of obviously. course. Now, which, which one is the engagement band and which one is, what, an anniversary band? Okay, this band? was my engagement ring, which is real. At least mm -hmm. it better be. Yeah, I was right. told it was. <laughs> And this is the ring that I was married with, the one closest to my heart. Uh, the one in the middle is CelebStyleJewelry.com. But you would never know. No. Because you mix it together so well. So how much do these run for? Anywhere from 15 actually, for your skinniest little right. band, to something more expensive would probably, like this is one of my most expensive pieces. This is definitely red carpet ready. Right. This is about 180 Okay, well, $180 for, you know, some fabulous bling that you'll wear forever. What, right, you can't go wrong. That's a steal. Um, the, the bracelets are in, you know, the 50s and 60s. Mm -hmm. This is one of my favorite bracelets. Wow. This, I, I really, I have a... Now, this one is a little bit more kind of showy. Yeah, this isn't an everyday piece. This is more of a dress-up piece. But I really have a thing for estate pieces. Mm -hmm. And I have a gorgeous antique Hamilton diamond watch. Mm -hmm. And so the whole front is very intricate. And on the side, there are these little squares with diamonds. Mm -hmm. So I'll double this bracelet with that, with watch. that watch. And again, it's all about mixing a little bit of real, a little bit of costume. Cost and costume. then being able to pull it off. Good word, costume. Not fake, not knockoff. Costume. costume. And then just being able to pull it off. Right. Well, I think it's a great line, Gabby. And thank, thank you so you. much for introducing me. And I can't wait to pick out. Let's see what I, let's see what I think I need. I definitely want these because um, these will be a great travel piece for me. They're, yep, those are nice they're a little bit piece. interesting. They're not too big. Big tip on wearing costume jewelry is don't get something so big and obnoxious that everybody knows it's fake. Just like Gabby said, when somebody compliments you on your earrings, just say thank you.